Hello YouTube, the last day of April and it's nearly 7 p.m. and welcome and I also have to apologize to you guys. I didn't realize that when I got this new phone, when I had been doing a lot of paranormal videos, they had gone on private so you guys have been missing out on a lot of stuff so apologies for that I've just gone today and relisted them all as public so I was wondering why haven't I got any views you know and it was because they were on private um, an update still haven't got the motion detector yet and for those of you who don't know what happened, the motion detector ran on batteries and the motion detector back was towards me and faced my husband's urn of ashes and every now and then it got triggered and I don't know why because where my husband's urn is, it's on a sideboard and there's nothing that can get behind it. Uh, there's no, no one can get behind it, no one can trigger it to the side, so why it was triggered I don't know. But when we get a new motion detector, we'll see if that phenomena is still happening. Alright, I've talked enough, so for those of you, this is how I do it, turn off the light, all the house light in my house are off except for the TV, you can see the TV. I'm actually watching paranormal videos on uh, Paranormal on Spotify. And there we have them. Look. Oh my goodness. I haven't had so many orbs in ages. And I'm wondering whether it's because the motion detector is out of action. Hello beautiful ones, can you go up towards the ceiling, go up, go up, up, that's it, go up, look, look at them going up, shows intelligence, look at that, that's not flies, it's not dust, I'm still in the bathroom by the way, and the other thing that tends to happen is I, because it's a cheap phone, my flashlight on my cheap phone, which only cost me a couple of hundred dollars, doesn't last long and it tends to turn off quickly. Now, if these were insects, I'd see them with my own eyes and I can't. I can only see the orbs through the camera. But I look with my eyes. I can see nothing. No, no, no orbs. Hello, orbs. Hello. What was that yellow orb that came to me on Easter Sunday? People have dismissed it as an insect, but it wasn't. Hello. Can you come to me, orbs? Change direction and come to me. Come this way towards my camera. Come to me. Stop flying upwards and come to me, please. Look how big, look at that. And these are normal, normal, oh look how big they are. Look at that one. Oh my goodness, did you see that one? Did you see that one? Not sure. Oh, and that one too. I haven't moved. Not too sure how much longer. My flashlight. And it's funny, when I seem to be unsettled in my mind, I will get more orbs. You know, like if there's a drama or something going on in my mind, it's like, I don't know, the orbs are like guardian angels or something? I don't know. Look at that. They're not insects. 
Hello, beautiful ones, and they have sort of come to me. Look, look. Tell me that was an insect. Hello. Can we have a really big one before my flashlight goes? Just in front of me? There's been a mist there. How about if I put it up here? You come up here. Up where my finger is. Look at that. Did you see that? They follow. That's intelligence. Insects don't follow you. I Last I know, you couldn't um, get insects to obey you. You know, you couldn't tell a fly, come here, fly. Or come, and I don't have fruit. It's, um, we're going into autumn here. I don't have fruit, fresh fruit lying around. Oh, look at that. Here. Yeah. I'm going to try to change. So my husband's urn is over there. I really, look, not sure how much longer. I would love to see that yellow orb again. It was not an insect. Hello, beloved. I'm not going to play the EMF. I have done that on many other videos. And the other difference is when there's insects. I can actually see the insect with my eye and they are kind of like a thin, silvery, thin uh, like, how can you describe it? Like a line, not these round, ovally shaped. Thank you very much, spirit. Look, it seems to have died down a bit. Oh, and there we go. Flash is disabled to prevent the device overheat. I'm just going to turn on my bright torch. See if we can get... So this is my torch. But we don't... It only seems through the camera. Oh, I don't, oh there's something. Can you see it? Did you see it? See? See that? Did you see that little white thing with my torch? It's not an insect. I don't have roaches running around on the ground. Can you manifest anything else with my torch? I'll step back a bit and see if we can get anything. So I've just got a simple little silver torch. No, it doesn't seem to be working. We did have that little silver thing. But I'm just going to turn on the light for you just to prove. And I'll turn on this light too just to prove to you that there are no insects in my house. Look. Look. Okay. No insects. There's the floor. Vacuumed a couple of days ago, so it's not... Because I have a house cleaner. No insects. Look. Look. This bathroom. The ceiling. There's no insects. I'll show you the floor again. No insects. We will just quickly, I'm just going to quickly turn off the bathroom light and just show you my husband's urns here. This is my husband and I when we were married and the urn used to sit, sorry, not the urn, the motion detector used to sit right here and face Rob. Now, I went away um, looking after my grandchildren, and when I came back, it was just like constantly on. I thought, oh, he's upset with me, and because it was constantly on all the time, it happened to break the motion detector. I tried new batteries. Anyway...
No EMF. Do you want to... There we go. Three lights. Do you want to play with all the lights? Do you want to turn all the lights on just before I end this? Hello, my beloved. That's my husband. Yeah, you did three lights. Do you want to turn them all on? Sometimes. There we go. Look. There we go. Thank you. So that's the only other proof. And there's nothing electrical here. It's just like you could call it an altar. You know, a couple of um, urns of ashes of dogs and my husband's urn of ashes. My desire, I've got another dog. When she dies, I'll cremate her. And then when I die, all these ashes, my husband's, the dogs and I will all be spread together over the ocean. Would you like that, Rob? You would? Would you like to do all the lights on again if you would like your ashes spread with mine? Well, we got some reaction. Are you with Jimmy? I think that's yes. When he flashes a couple, I take that as yes. Is that right? Yes. And I think it just shows off when he just does the whole lot. So this thing in the middle here is where, look, just to show you that I cannot do anything. It is only in the middle here that clicks on and off. But me holding it the side, there's no way that I can do the lights. Look. So there's no deceit here. That This is the point here. Click. But when I hold it in my hand like that, that's not me. And there is nothing electrical here. Oh, my torch just fell down. Nothing electrical. And I kind of missed the motion detector because when it came on, I knew my husband was around. So stay tuned. The motion detector will be back. And good night, beloveds. And... I just want to say one more thing. The reason I do these paranormal videos is so that you all have hope and belief that once you die, that's not the end. Life goes on. Thank you guys for watching. May you have a really good night. Sleep tight. Loving blessings, cherish your loved ones, please, because when they're gone, the remorse and guilt that you have that you could have been better at this and better at that never leaves you. Love you, Robbie. Thanks, guys. I'm turning this off. So it's now off, and I'm going to end the video. My flashlight won't come back on my camera. Otherwise, I would have done it. As I said, it's a very cheap camera. So, yeah, so what used to happen, just before I quickly go, is the motion detector, say that's the motion detector, would sit there facing Rob's urn and it would be triggered. And you can see there's nothing, nobody here to trigger it. So it has to be Rob. All right, good night. Thank you.